Alright, what is up? This is Slow Plays, and I'm back in some more Dragon Ball Legends news and content here on the channel. Very excited for another V Jump leak for this month. We finally got some of these scans going through quite uh quite fast. I wasn't expecting them to drop this fast, but um it was a little bit earlier this morning. It was like I think at like 1 or 2 a.m. Uh, I just woke up, so we're gonna go ahead and grind all this out and explain uh i guess as much as we possibly can so big shout outs to goresh for translations shout outs to uh miguel uh i believe on twitter as well uh for the actual scan you know getting the actual image and stuff now when it comes to dokkan um all that's shown was something about the tanabata banner or wh whatever the hell it's called so don't worry about dokkan too much it's just saying that the um lr fusions are going to return on uh, that Tanabata banner or what, how, however you pronounce it, whatever it is. Yeah, that, that banner that they usually do uh, all the time where they have like the anniversary units. So that's coming back. So that's going to be coming back and that's really it. No new character information on that uh, currently right now at this very time. So Legends is what's important. Um, as you can see, what I'm actually looking at is quite awesome here. Here's a better look so you guys can kind of see it zoomed in here. But um, we have a new Super Saiyan Blue Goku and Vegeta, and this isn't just like any normal one, I mean, I guess in a sense it's the normal versions that you guys are probably more used to, not the Whis Gi Resurrection F. Uh, what it seems to be, I think this is the Goku Black Arc, so they're finally moving into it. Uh, we had predictions of this, you know, before that they were eventually going to do this. I wasn't expecting another Vegeta after we already got the legendary finish Vegeta, the green one, but hey, you know, I'll take it, it's gonna be cool. Um, they're both very different. Uh, you have this Goku right here, who is going to specialize in strike attacks, and as you can see right here, it does state that he will have the Super God Strike, so I guess, um, kind of like the thing from, you know, Xenoverse 2, he has a Super God Strike thing with Super Saiyan God, so it's gonna be similar, but, you know, obviously he, you know, he, he does this a lot. <laughs> he does this quite a bit, but no, seriously, in the, um, Goku Blackheart, you can definitely tell from the image in the back how he's, uh, holding... I guess like, you know, the heart area or whatever. Isn't that where he got like stabbed or something like that? It's something that happened, but uh, that's what that reminds me of. Now, at first I did, did think this was the tournament power, but I had to look at it a little bit closer because you also have Vegeta who's doing this, he's doing this. So I do love um, the actual like angles and you know, the art uh, for these images. They look fantastic. So Goku will be strike. Uh, he'll specialize in his, you know, blast or whatever. And um, apparently, Goku is reinforced when the enemy on ground changes. So basically, what that means is that I guess uh, as the fight goes on, he's gonna get more powerful. Uh, obviously, uh, so it's like a you know time-based sort of thing. And whenever they switch, an opponent switches, uh, he does get a buff. So he gets buffs whenever he switches. Now, when it comes to Vegeta, it says Vegeta will grant bonuses to allies uh, when he is unable to fight. So. I guess after he, you know, dies or whatever, or possibly when he gets switched or whatever, I'm assuming whenever he dies, um, you know, he strengthens uh, and, you know, gives those bonuses to, to the allies, the other two allies on the team. So, uh, I mean, I guess that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Uh, he will specialize in Blast, by the way, if I didn't already clarify that. So, Vegeta will be Blast, uh, Goku will be, uh, I guess, the Strike or whatever, with Super God Strike, and Vegeta will have, um, I guess... I think it's Gallic Gun, right? Yeah, that's what it is. It says Gallico. <laughs> the Gallico. But yes, uh, as you can see, he's using the Gallic Gun. I think he had Final Flash in the uh, green Legendary Finish version. So, um, yes, we're finally getting the more traditional costumes. Uh, Goku with the orange and blue gi. Vegito with the blue armor. Uh, we don't have to, you know, I like the Resurrection F and everything, and they look cool, but it's nice to see these finally getting some love uh, from the Goku Black Arc. So, we're still on the Goku Black Arc. Uh, I thought we were jumping to Turn of Power, but not quite yet. So, again, uh, big shout-outs to Miguel for the scans, Goresh for translations, and all that great stuff. Uh, I will be updating with more news uh, whenever that actually does drop, but if you wanted to see their stats, there they are. This right here, I'm not really going to worry about too much. I don't think it's really anything that major significant i think the characters are the main focus so uh be sure to subscribe leave a like i will update you guys on more news when it drops and until then my friends stay safe love y'all peace